All right, welcome to Boomer Axe. Apparently, this is a very brutal game where you have an axe that is like a boomerang, but if you don't parry the axe yourself, you will take damage. And I believe this is a keyboard and mouse game because you're actually going to be pointing at enemies, from what I can see. Um, the music already sounds pretty sick. Um, this might actually be harder than Rocket League. I'm not even kidding you. Uh, okay, so it says we have to do arrow keys or WASD. Study up. Launch the boomerang. It is your only weapon. So I can walk over it, but if I grab it, I hit the enemy and then it drops. Okay. Carry it when it comes back or it hurts you too. So I have to click every time. So if I don't, if I don't hit it, yeah, and it keeps bouncing too. So even after I get hit, it still bounces off of me. So it'll keep going. The axe deals ricochet damage once it's to, uh, once to its target and returns. It also deals spin damage to any enemies it passes through. So there's ricochet damage and spin damage. So I can change targets and move around. That is crazy. So there's gonna be a lot of like timing. Oh, and I actually have a cooldown on my on my. Oh, you see up here. Interesting. Okay, so every time I attack, I can punch, but there's a cooldown on my punch. So we gotta be really careful about when we ricochet off of enemies because if we're too close, we might actually have a problem. Oh my, this is brutal already. Oh, okay, this is hard. <laughs> This is very hard. I missed. You've got to be very careful with your timing. Did I also lose a permanent max HP? This is going to take a bit of time to get used to. Okay, what was this? Oh. We get an item. Plus one spin damage. Okay, so it's going to be important that I actually go... I got an extra HP. It's going to be important that I go through enemies. Oh wait, let me let me uh, ricochet back that really fast there. Oh. Oh my. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're getting some cash. Are there shops? I guess we'll find out. There must be. I'm getting used to the timing. 105 bucks. Like I'm focusing on my character, but also focusing on the axe. Like it's hard to point at what I want to actually hit. It seems like we're doing spin damage as well on the enemies. So even on single target, we're doing spin damage. Plus two seek speed, minus two ricochet or return speed, and one ricochet damage. I'm gonna take that, and that means that it'll be a little bit easier for me to time. Yeah, see, it's a little bit slower coming back to me. Nice. I got 160. Oh. Much easier to deal with, and we don't actually lose any travel time because it's moving faster towards enemies. And now we're strong enough we can just one shot. Oh, we got a boss. <laughs> I missed my shot. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're doing okay. Oh, I just gotta focus on my. Oh, what are you doing? How am I alive? I got him. How did I live through that? Okay, we're good. The depths. 
Okay. Oh, no item. No item for beating the boss, huh? Okay, we survived. We got 200 bucks. And the axe killed me. Wow. <laughs> um. Oh, what are these? Oh. Un unlockables. Unlocks bigums. What is bigums? You have it now. I I have bigums. So I'm uh, these must be like power ups I can get in the game. So I have to win a fight without parrying. <laughs> what? So I have to just deal damage to myself. Find a reward room after defeating a boss. Oh, so I have to actually like get that, and I have no money to buy anything. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess we just go for another run. And we have bigums. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe it makes my axe bigger. That's the only thing I could assume. Nice. Okay. Hey, okay, a bit of a grind. We got extra HP. Oh, it's a turtle. Oh, he's got a laser. What the? <laughs> Why are there turtles with lasers? Ow. That is so... You do not want to be near enemies at all. Like, you just don't. Oh, we got an item. Hot stuff. Ricochet enemies melt. So it's like burn damage. Yeah, I think it's I think it's burn damage. It's pretty nice. So if I like go for other enemies. Like that. Yeah, so I can like kind of switch switch targets. And let, let them burn. Oh, it, it actually bounced off of him. When it died. This game is not easy. I am getting used to it, though. We should get an item soon, I think. I would say so far the most annoying enemies are like the Sphinx. Whatever it is. Blender, spin damage. I really prefer ricochet damage over over blender, but or spin damage. Uh, spin damage is not as great as ricochet, I would say. Okay. Oh, and I'm dead. I died just like that. Okay, we have enough money. What do we, what do we get? Find a reward room after defeating a boss. Guarantee at least one treasure room per floor. Wait, so it doesn't even it doesn't even actually happen. I think I might just build up for the ricochet damage. Plus two damage is pretty good. So let's try to aim to get for this run. Let's try to aim to get like 155 bucks. Oh, I thought that guy wouldn't like attack until I hit him. All right. Extra HP, I'll definitely take that. By the way, this game is $2 on Steam. Absolute steal. I love these arcade looking games. Like modern arcade, basically. I have never focused so hard in a game. My, jo my jaw is wide open. I'm, I'm drooling. I got an item. Sleek Seeker, we got this before, so yeah, extra damage and makes it move a little faster towards enemies, but slower towards me. I can't tell if the spin the spin is like inconsistent whether you do double damage on the enemy. It might be based on the direction the enemy's moving. Like if the enemy's moving away from the axe, you might do ricochet da uh, it might do spin damage on top of the ricochet. I'm not really sure. Oh, I messed up my, my dodge. If you don't get the dodge, you don't get the reset. I think that's what it is. So it punishes your timing if you mess up. A 
Okay, good. We're almost at five hundred dollars. Go through that enemy. You gotta make sure I get make use of the spin. Other item here. Ricka boom. Ricocheting off an enemy deals explosion damage to all enemies in the room. Uh huh. I will take that. So it doesn't work on the turtles because they're invulnerable. Oh, he's dead. I think it even does damage to the to the turtle or to the enemy that I hit as well. Looks like there's a cooldown maybe. All right, here we go. Take our time here. Oh, there we go. I've played my fair share of bullet hell games, so it shouldn't this shouldn't be too bad. Although I am playing like a rhythm game at the same time. Oops. I am taking so much damage. I survived. <laughs> I thought I was dead there for sure. All right, depth time. This is a big room. Okay. And we're good. Six hundred bucks. Six hundred bucks could be good. I don't know what that gives it, gets us, but we at least have the ricochet damage. I would love some HP or an item, maybe. Okay, sweet. Bigums one plus boomerang size and ricochet damage increased. How much bigger is it gonna be? Oh my! I don't know if I like that. Do I like that? That's not necessarily good. It could be worse. Okay, we're good. We're doing okay though. We got almost 800 bucks. That's huge. The explosion damage is actually doing really, really good work here. Okay, another upgrade. Pierce. Boomerang hurts invulnerable enemies. So, like the turtles. <laughs> Pretty much only the turtles, I think. Yeah, it does. Okay, let's keep going. What is that thing? Wait. Did that bounce back faster towards me? I think it did. That enemy, I don't I don't know what that enemy was. I think we increase Oh. <laughs> I'm $5 off. Although I I'm pretty sure I just want the ricochet damage anyway, so let's go for it. I don't know if anybody else feels this way, but the axe seems so tiny now. I, it seems so small. Game's brutal. I, f I can feel myself getting better though. Let's take this. Ricochet enemies melt. I didn't really get a good run with that last time, so maybe. Maybe that could be good. Nice. The second the enemies die, the, the axe stops moving, which is very helpful. Oh, what? I really thought I was aiming at the, the dude below. It's so weird when an enemy dies while the axe is going towards it. So that that's a big problem with the, the melting. 
that I can change my timing, my internal timing. I thought I was going to go through the enemy. Oh, man. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, actually, I'm not sure I like this. This melting. Yeah, it's causing issues for me a little bit. I can see the problem when, when the axe goes through and then... Like that, yeah. Like, I'm in, in my head, I'm thinking about the timing of it bouncing back. I mean, I should, I should be able to react to it. Okay, Sleek Seeker again. So we are quite strong. But I don't rate our chances very high on uh, 1 HP for the boss. So strange. Let me have the boss now. Okay, we have to basically survive this in one hit. I think he does a charge every one quarter HP. I'm not really sure though. Oh, I missed my shot. Oh, that's tough. Okay, what 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 are these unlockables? Do we have anything that? Defeat the final boss. Oh my god. Leave everything behind in a treasure room. I might just do that really quick to get a new upgrade. Get hit nine times in a run, so have a lot of health. Get hit and abandon a run in the first room. <laughs> okay. End run. <laughs> what is this? What does it give me? Loyal? What is that? I don't know what loyal does. Die in the first room of any floor. Let's go do that real quick, too. There we go. That doesn't count. What do we got? Very parry. Win a fight without parrying. Yeah, that one's... I don't know if that one's possible yet. If we get an, a very easy first room... I did it. Nice. Okay, let's end the run. Alright, so we have all of these. We don't have get hit nine times in a run and leave everything behind. So if I do a treasure room and leave, then I can get that one too. Should be dead. Now, if I get hit before the treasure room, I'll keep going. And then I'll end the run. But if we have a good run going, I'll probably just keep it going. Sweet. What? The timing is so small. The window is very small. Oh, okay. I thought I got hit there. Well, like I Oh, I, supposed, I was supposed to leave it behind. <laughs> Carrying the boomerangs deals explosion damage. Okay. That's very nice, actually. So if you get that and the explosion on the attack, you're basically doing damage to the entire room over and over again. All right, next item room. We got we to gotta abandon. trapped okay how do you how do you leave everything behind in a treasure room did that work it didn't give me it but let's see let's see Leave everything behind in a treasure room. Do I have to end the run, maybe? I don't understand. I could have bought the... Uh, I think I could have bought the spin damage, too. Which might have been good.
I'm upset. <laughs> yeah, what do, we want to upgrade the spin damage. What is 800? 1800 for that. Collecting helmet. These are both eight, uh, 750. Yet another option. Okay, so let's go for the spin damage for now. And I don't find that I do too much spin damage, but it could be pretty helpful. I say that, and it's it's one-shotting every enemy in the room. Okay, so. Okay, yeah, uh, that was huge. That's really good. Minus two return, so it's slower. But spin damage is increased. So I don't do damage as fast. But the game is a little easier. So I'll, I'll take it. Plus we do more damage. So I mean, like even though we are going a little slower, we'll, we'll do more damage overall, maybe. A little more manageable when the when the axe is near you. It seems inconsistent whether it'll kill the enemies in one hit. I don't think they're gaining HP on this floor. Okay. So we got the Rick Boom again. Now we need just the uh, very parry and we do a lot of explosion damage. What? I hit, I definitely hit that. Cheap. Oh, we got the HP back. The game was like, I'm sorry. Yeah, that was cheap. All right, here we go. So we are still getting the explosion damage, it looks like. Oh, okay, we got it. That was pretty scary. I was, I was close to getting hit by the bullet and the axe there. Down a floor we go. So we gotta be really mindful of that one enemy that I hit. I'm not even sure what it was, but it ricocheted my axe back to me much faster. This thing. Okay. Oh, that's fast. That's very fast. I wonder if that's even faster if uh, if we have the normal speed of the weapon. Probably. This is good though. Another item. Plus one bonus ricochet damage per ricochet per room. Wait, what? Wait, so every ricochet gets stronger? I think so. Isn't that kind of broken? What is that? Yeah, I think it's doing more and more damage. Is this anything? Can't walk on it. Okay. Oh, he went back to his... I didn't realize he can go back to his form. Okay. So it looks like when we leave the room, we lose that... We lose that HP lo uh, slot. So maybe there's a way to heal it back. I'll take an easy room, no problem. That one didn't die in one hit. I'm not even sure why. Another item here. 
Boomerang, Boomerang hurts invulnerable enemies. Okay, so that's, yeah, the deal with the turtles. Will also hurt uh, the, I believe it'll hurt the bounce back guys. Like porcupines or something? I'm not really sure what they are. Nice. This is going very well. Oh boy, what is this? Oh, that goes faster. Okay, hitting the main dude is faster. I didn't know that. What is happening? This is insane. <laughs> this, this boss is insane. What just happened? We're still, I don't have any of these yet. Like, what was that? Finding a, a okay, find a reward room after defeating a boss. I should probably do that. Let's let's grab that. Extra extra items. You can't tell me that wasn't insane. Crazy game. We are definitely getting stronger, and I think that's the whole point, is that you're going to get more upgrades, more weapons, or more weapon upgrades as you go. Additional target if re-aimed while seeking. What? So, like... Wait, what is... I don't... I, I just... <laughs> it just it's, that seems horrible. I don't, I don't know if I just played that wrong or I just don't get what's happening. I, I, I'm pretty sure I like re-aimed all the way up those left guys and I didn't expect it to go flying past me towards the other enemy I aimed at. So it's like, I guess it's whatever enemy is being aimed at when the axe hits it. I don't, I can't tell you really. I think, I think that's what it is though. This game is brutal. You have to like be so... Focused on the bullets coming at you, the enemies around the room, the axe, timing it, Rickaboom. Yeah, I'll do explosion damage. I want to get Rickaboom and Very Parry in one run. And I hit the red bullet, dude. I got so scared of the axe being so close to me. It also seems like sometimes the enemies don't get the explosion. Maybe it's when an enemy dies. Yeah. So when an enemy does, dies, it doesn't ricochet off the enemy. Or it doesn't count as a ricochet. Well, that one did. But maybe that was the spin damage that killed him afterwards. That could have been what it, what it is. Yeah, see, the ricochet hit, and then the spin damage didn't hit, so... I don't know. I couldn't tell you. Oh, no. Okay, we're trying the flirtatious again. Let's see. Let's see what happens. I, I get so confused with what to do. Like, it's so hard to focus on this. Oh, shoot. Coins. Like, I think it's good if I can get used to it. Yeah, like, that's really good. But it's also just, like, an, another element to focus on in the game, which is already hard. We're in trouble. Yeah, that was just bad. I was in a bad spot. I couldn't really move around. Let's see if I can buy something. Let's go for the guaranteed one treasure per floor. I'm not really sure what that even means because we're already getting like one or two treasures per floor. I guess sometimes you can get like no treasures. Oh, like is it per room? Wait, that's huge then. Like this is considered a floor. Oh no no! See, like there's nothing. I, I don't know. 
I would consider these rooms, right? Like, we are getting more treasures and and an upgrade. Rickaboom, yeah, Rickaboom is always good. I don't know. I don't know. We're definitely seeing more treasures. Oh, you know what I just realized? That's a treasure room. So I have to leave the coins behind in a treasure room. I would have thought the upgrade is a treasure room, but maybe not. I get it now. So when we find a treasure, we have to walk around the coins. That's reckoning's huge. I think reckoning's gonna be really big for the boss fight. I think it's doing bonus damage. I can't tell though. And we're flawless. Let's go. And we get a reward here, I think. Oh, I gotta take that one. Like that one's really good. I gotta take that. I think if I find one with like three little coins, I will I will I will avoid it. I just said I would, so... Yeah, there we go. That's the treasure room. Wasn't fully clear, but we made it work. This game's sick. Man, that is annoying. I hope I can kill those guys in one hit soon. Oh, there we go. Yeah, one invulnerable enemies get hit, so that should help a lot. Now we're really racking up the cash. We're getting better at ricocheting too. I'm always scared of targeting the enemy that's really close to me. Very good. Wait for the bullets. Four HP in a dream. We got that big boss coming up, though. I'm kind of scared. One more upgrade. Ricochet enemies melt. Okay, that's that could be good. That could be bad. We we've discovered that like, that could be an issue later on with uh, enemies melting away. But all right. Yeah, like that. I gotta just be very mindful of. Enemies dying before the axe reaches it. I hope it'd be wise to leave one. I definitely hit that. I might be wise to leave one of the tentacles up in case it's one of those games where when you when you have all of them like ridded ridded of they uh, they come back or maybe not. Thread the needle. We did it. Okay, we're playing much better. And we get a treasure here too. 
Oh, that's so nice. That is so nice. The pokies. I'm assuming those hurt you. I'm not sure though. I I'm gonna assume. I don't want to test it. If it happens naturally, so be it, but I'm avoiding the walls. It messed up my timing. It messed up my timing again. That was just me being bad though. Perfect. New item. Bigums. Oh boy. <laughs> Here we go. Good. Over a thousand gold here. What? All right, good so far. Be very careful with those uh, ricochet guys. Please die! Oh no! Oh my god! He he just wouldn't die. Leftovers. Add that. Get hit nine times. I feel like that was close to nine times. Power ups off or offer an additional option. That could be really good. Collecting helmets gives one ricochet damage is probably huge though, I feel like. Let's go with the additional option for now. We're only like 250 bucks off of the additional option. Or uh additional ricochet damage, but like, that's pretty much a guaranteed extra damage per boss, I think, because every boss has that helmet with the the six coins around it. At least I'm assuming it does. We could have just been get, getting lucky. I see this additional option here. Ooh, wait, this is actually really huge. One ricochet damage, the boomerangs cannot be parried by enemies. That means that the, uh,. I think the turtle can't be... Like, that's basically better than the invulnerable damage. I think. We'll see when we find a turtle. Okay, you can still... You can still... Dodge that. But I think that means that the, uh... Porcupine or whatever, whatever that thing is. I think it, it must not be able to uh, hit the axe back at me fast. Easy cash. We're almost at 750 anyway. Boomerax and Holt hurts and vulnerable enemies. Okay, so we basically have all oh, haymakers huge though. I think I go for the overall better damage. I mean, yeah, I was stuck in a corner there. That was just bad, bad positioning. Let's keep going. We're so strong. So far, I think the best item in the game is the uh, increased ricochet damage every hit that you get in a room. Because for the bosses, it just does so much damage.
Why is he going so crazy, man? Stop it. Okay, we're good. We should get an extra health here. So if we had the other upgrade, that would be plus one damage permanently. That's so good. What? What? What's ha why is my ricket? Why is my button not working? Is my mouse broken? It, it, it didn't go three times. I guess we'll get this. All right. So now helmets give us extra damage. This has got to be the run. We technically now have everything in our arsenal except for the final boss item. And I think one other we didn't get. For getting hit nine times in a run. All right, here we go. What, what do we get? One spin damage. I think I go for loyal. That's like so much better than spin damage. And I think that means the second boss can't parry my axe back to me, which is good. We hope to find just random health uh, well, yeah, random health helmets. Now, now I'm wondering, is it... Did this say collected helmets or the amount of helmets I have? Is it three extra damage right now or is it... I didn't read it enough carefully to fully understand. Because my original idea was that it's... Any collected helmet permanently gives plus one. But it might be the fact that I have three, so I get three damage. What do we have here? Ooh. I'm going for the bigger damage just for melting, but. Here we go. Plus one damage. Whether or not it's permanent is up in the air right now. I don't know. And we're good. I'm being very mindful of the fact that enemies could melt away when the axe is going towards it. I mean, the melting seems good for the bosses. There we go. And we might get another plus one damage here as well. I think it looks like it's guaranteed. We haven't had a, a boss that isn't six coins and a uh, health upgrade. Yeah, I got trolled by the melting. Uh, it's tough. It's just going to happen, but it does do so much damage. It's kind of good. Okay. I don't know if these turtles ever stop lasering. I can't tell. I don't think they do, though. They can really trap you. Which is why I focused it on that run. I wasn't wanting to get caught in a corner again. Leave remnants on Ricochet? I'm not really sure what that does. I, 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 maybe I should test it. Extra damage. So it, it looks like it constantly does spin damage on the... The enemy. Yeah, that's huge. And that probably has something to do with uh, my spin damage as well. That's broken. Yeah, 
Yeah, they no longer parry my axe back to me faster. That's really good. I think that'll be the same for the boss, too. This should melt through the uh, tentacles. Boomerang hurts invulnerable enemies. And plus ricochet. Yep, I mean, definitely. We're so strong. Yeah, you can really get trapped. That is tough. Look at that, we're just melting through everything. Yeah, I'm just gonna get hit here, and I'm getting hit again. That's awesome. Get rid of the last tentacle real quick, too. We should be okay here. There we go. Yeah, we're pretty strong. Hopefully we can get another HP here. The pokies. We're back to the pokies. And we're reliably making it here too. Which is good. I got scared of the laser. I didn't focus on my axe. Oopsie. What is this thing? I am scared. I'm probably going to die here. An upgrade though. Oh, I feel like ricocheting off an enemy deals explosion damage is actually better than plus two ricochet damage. Because this already does two damage, I think. We need health really badly. Focusing up, I don't want to die here. Oh no, I didn't see the red bullet from the other dude. Oh, I tried to walk through the middle of those ones. Dang it, man. Oh no. Is there anything else I can grab? I don't think so. It's literally just the extra option. And we have to get sticky. So sticky sounds like the, the axe is going to stick on an enemy. It really is just get good at this point. I should have read the uh, helmet thing again. Okay, item. Boomerang seeks additional targets. I'm gonna go for a seek speed uh, with the ricochet. I don't know if I like the re-aiming. The re-aiming is a little weird. Okay, we get bonus damage. So my axe moves faster towards the enemies now. I like that. This one just feels good. <gasps> I trolled. No. I don't find the bears that difficult to deal with. Yep, 
Reckoning is huge. Probably the biggest damage upgrade in the game. It really punishes you if you miss. Damage upgrade. I mean, how was I supposed to avoid that? <laughs> and he's dead. That is crazy. Just how how many bullets can come at you if he comes close to you like that. All right, we have a lot of helmets, so I think our damage should be pretty high. And once we get 1800, we basically should be able to cater our run to our liking. I can't tell, but I think my ricochet is like doing 19, 15 damage or something. Yeah, it says 20. So it is going up per hit, as I thought it would. Slow and steady. Go for ricochet enemies uh, melt because it's just more damage. The spin damage is okay, but it's not as good as constant two damage, especially for bosses. Now I don't know is, what I don't know is if the ricochet off of the parry or the invulnerable enemies counts as a bonus damage or not. I'm trying to see the numbers and see if it works. I missed my parry. What are you doing next to me? What is going on? The run is falling apart. Let's go slow and steady. Yeah, that uh, already messed me up. <laughs> it's, just, it's just so bad. We got enough for the extra item though. This this could probably be could probably be the run, you know? I said that last time, but now we have extra options to choose from so we can really make sure our run is broken. I still haven't had a run where I have both explosions on parry and ricochet. Let's see what we get. Ricochet enemies melt. The remnant seems really broken. I'm gonna go for that again. It, it like basically just melts everything on it. Yeah. Definitely the play early. Two HP? We're melting through the rooms now. Sweet. Next item, we got three options, as always. Ooh, this is tough, actually, because spin damage, I think, has to do with the remnants. So I think this is better. Which is crazy to say that spin is actually better now. Yeah, it's doing, it's doing fives now, so... I think we're, yeah, we're getting like three or four hits in with the spin.
Miss my ricochet or my parry. Yeah, spin damage is huge. We should get a, another health here. Now, does money even matter at this point? I don't think it matters. I'm pretty sure my attacks can still be parried, yeah. I might get the uh, no parrying next because it's really good. Now that I think about it, those might be hedgehogs. But I'm not really sure because it, it's kind of hard to tell what they are. I'm going to go for a boomerang explosion. Very parry. Going, got another item here. I'm hoping for maybe ricochet damage now, or oh, I did say we never got this before, so I think we do it. We got Rickaboom and Perry. It already seems pretty disgusting. Coins for no reason. Coins for no reason. Love to see that. Here we go. To be honest, the parrying kind of makes the game go faster because they're giving me my axe back faster. So I don't really technically mind it. Yeah, it, it definitely makes the fight a lot faster with the parry. As long as you can get used to the speed. Bonus health again. And like I said, I still don't know if it's actually damage based on how many helmets I have. Run does seem seem pretty busted though. Another item. Looking for a reckoning. Explosions from parries and ricochets deals five times weight. What? Wait, this is literally disgusting. <laughs> what? Is that like a synergy thing? And everything's dead. Everything's just popping now. Okay. Uh huh. Extra damage again. 
I think I go for plus two ricochet damage. This is literally just a winning run. There's no way. Okay. It's got a, it does have a lot of HP, and I don't know what his attacks are going to be like. I don't think it matters. I don't think it matters. Another HP. Next floor, the dark. We got a free item at the very start. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I think I want I probably want the parry though, because I'm not sure what the. This is just mean. This is just mean. This is extremely mean. I don't know what's happening. That was so mean. That was so mean. What is that? What? What did we get? We got sticky. I can't believe that. We had the god run and we still lost to that. I don't even know what the heck that was. We have to fight two of the tentacle bosses too? Like I don't I don't understand. Two bonus HP. I still didn't read the helmet thing. <laughs> if this isn't it, I can't. I'm just. I don't know. I, I don't know what to do. Two ricochet. You know, I really jinxed it when I said this was a one run. I'm curious what the sticky thing is. Onwards. Speed run. Break a boom. Okay, here, here's the start. We just need the opposite. I am speed running this. Yeah, you're not a problem. You know, I've dealt with three of you at once, so I think I can do this. Okay. No, I said I could deal with three of you, but I'm sorry. I, I apologize. Bonus damage. Let's keep it going. Bonus damage again. Please give me uh, very parry. 
Boomerang slows while in contact with enemies. So it's like gonna do more spin damage? Let's try it. We haven't tried it before. Yeah, I think it spins more on the enemies. I thought I was going to parry again. Sometimes, oh, what the? What the heck, man? Oh, I messed up. Not a great run so far. Two HP is not looking good. Very parry. There it is. Stuck at a quarter. There we go. I probably want to spin through things. Stuck in a corner. I'm dead. <laughs> I pinned myself in a corner because I didn't kill those things fast enough. Oh man. Okay. This is it. This is the last one. I'm going to go for the invulnerable enemies. Okay. I am just speed running. No care in the world. Ow. Please give me something good. Remnants is good. The two ricochet is good too, but I really like the remnant. It just does so much damage. Onwards. I'm tired of this stupid pigeon, man. Or it's like an ostrich? I don't really know what this thing is. Alright. Moving on. Not a lot of health, though. Stop! Stop! I thought that was going to die off that one hit. It seems like because I'm damaging the enemy, he constantly goes back into his shell. That's a really bad combo, actually. Oh, reckoning so good, though. But I feel like the explosions are just too broken. I gotta go for very parry here.
All right. We have so much money. Onwards. We are speed running now. And we got Rick and Boom. Yep. Now we just stand back and we win. Goodbye. Deal with these tentacles as soon as possible, and we should be able to get out of this area. No, no. Here we go. One HP in a dream. How did I not die there? Okay, we survived. Uh, this is not looking good though for the run, I'm gonna be honest with you. One HP, we got two now, but still. If we can get stand back, we might have a chance. I'm gonna need a lot of HP for that three pigeon or ostrich, whatever that thing is, boss. All right, please give me stand back. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so we have a chance. Okay, we are melting now. I don't even know about what I want here. Oh, reckoning. Yep. There we go. Extra health is huge. Give me more, please. If all the things go right, the max I can have right now Guaranteed is four HP. Yeah, so it looks like we're gonna have four HP going into this boss, the three pigeons. <laughs> I don't know, I really don't know what they are. Why is this the final? boss before the... So you can stand here and just do this over and over again. Like that seems like such an easier boss than the, pr the first two. Although I do have the... Uh, so I do have the stand back, which is killing those things that are supposed to spawn more bullets, but it's really not that hard. The dark. One more item here. I think this boomerang seeks additional targets and just going between the enemies would be the biggest play here. But it's already like so difficult. A 
like, how am I supposed to avoid that? I don't understand. Oh, I got to rage quit. I'm sorry, but I, I, I might come back to this and try that again. But what is that boss? Like, that is just like so ridiculous. You just focus on so many things. <sighs> Goodbye.